Prince Vasily always spoke languidly, like an actor repeating a stale part. Anna Pavlovna, sure, on the contrary, despite her 40 years, overflowed with animation and impulsiveness. To be an enthusiast had become her social vocation, and sometimes even when she did not feel like it, she became enthusiastic in order not to disappoint the expectations of those who knew her. The subdued smile, which, though it did not suit her faded features, always played round her lips expressed, as in a spoiled child, a continual consciousness of her charming defect, which she neither wished nor could nor considered it necessary to correct. So this is great. Um, this is a very long paragraph, mm -hmm. but it's actually a great paragraph because we, we understand a lot of the things that we learned before. And it's almost like a summary paragraph. Oh, sorry, I cannot. It's okay. I'm just saying it's like a summary. Summary. Because okay. we learned a lot about these two guys, yes. to Anna and, Anna and Prince. And this paragraph sort of like just tries to confirm what we already learned. Oh. Almost like that. So what is saying about the Prince? It says, Prince always spoke languidly, like okay. an actor kind of like a slowly you know like where you know he's older or whatever oh. right uh, like, like an, an actor, actor repeating, repeating a stale part stale. Stale, stale part means not very interesting part so oh. actor saying something oh, repeating, repeating a stale. very stale part so he, he talks like that he's that type of person yes right? or talks like or that talk, talk. He's speaking and anna like that. on the other hand despite her even though she's only 40 now we know her age. Oh. She's 40. Despite her 40 years, even so, though... So on the country, is, uh, on the other hand? On the, uh, on the opposite. On the opposite. Not, like, not like Prince Vasily. Oh, Vasily really? is kind of like slow, whatever. The she, on the other hand, overflowed. Overflowed, oh, overflowed means like, you know, you have a cup of overflow with water. Oh. You, too much water. Oh, in the what does that mean? Somebody has too much water. Too much water. Over too much so energy? what? Yeah, exactly. She has like overflowed with animation and impulsiveness. She's animation. very animated. She's like she moves a lot, and she's like impulsive is like what we found before. She changes quickly to one subject to another subject. Impulsive she's impulsive. Animation. She acts on her emotions a lot. Oh, I, I feel like upset, and she does something. I feel happy now. I change. Oh. She just changes a lot. Right, impulsive. Oh. So she's like a little child, kind of, right? She's impulsive, right? Mm -hmm. uh, to be an enthusiast, to be an enthusiast had become her social vocation. So um, this is, um, enthusiast here means um, somebody who is enthusiastic. It's to be somebody who's animated, somebody who is always, like, um, excited about things, right? Oh. Has become her, her social vocation. It became her job, like a social job. Oh. And sometimes, even when she did not feel like it, she became enthusiastic in order not to disappoint the expectation of those who knew her. So hmm, she's saying that even, you know, enthusiastic, you know what it means now? Full of energy. Full of energy. So it says, even when she doesn't, she, even when she's not enthusiastic, she becomes enthusiastic so that she will not disappoint people who thinks like she everybody expects him to be enthusiastic oh, so he don't want to people feel disappointed even even maybe she's very tired but she correct. Pre pretend she's very full of energy, energy correct oh right mm. the subdued smile uh, subdued means like not really full smile kind of like less um, kind of not not a real smile kind of oh, uh, fake man no not fake just Less energy smile, let's oh, put it that way, energy. subdued smile, which though it did not suit her faded features. Suit her faded features? Well, she, I guess faded means that she doesn't have very clear features. Maybe her... Oh, her, No, her, maybe her mouth... So. No, maybe her mouth is small or she doesn't have very, like, big features. What feature? Features... Features just... Oh, how, how she looks like, right? Yeah. So, so faded... Fit. Faded just means not very clear. When you look at her, it's kind of hard to see like what her. Not very clear. Oh. No, it just means some people are like that. You cannot tell. It's very you know maybe they don't have big eyes or big mouth or whatever. Oh. It's kind of like small, tiny, kind of faded. It's kind of like or or maybe not very contrast, not very big contrast. Oh. It's not suit. Did not suit, right? Oh, not suit. Oh. Always played round her lips, expressed as. 
always played around her lips, expressed as in a spoiled child the continual uh, conscious, uh, consciousness of her charming defect, which she neither wished nor could not consider necessary to correct. Okay, so this is about her smile, okay? And uh, say that although this smile, although this smile did not suit her faded features, it always played around her lips ex expressed. That is, it always was there. So she has this, like this kind of smile. A, conti a continual consciousness of her charming defect. Okay, so continual means always, kind of like always going. Mm. Consciousness. consciousness of her charming defect. So defect means something like a defection, right? Something not, not completely right, right? Defect, like a, a fault. Mm. Like uh, something that is not a it's not a good point. It's a bad point about someone. Not a defect or something that is a fault on you, right? Mm. Um, it's a defect. Mm. But she's saying that this smile is like a a defect. It's not uh, a good point about her. Let's say right. So just imagine somebody who has a smile like this. You know, like mm. right. So she always has a smile on her face. Mm. It's not like really real or whatever. And she puts it. She always puts it there, right? And, and though, although it's a defect, and she didn't uh, wish that, nor could, not consider it necessary to correct. And she never wanted to correct it. She never wanted to remove this defect. So she just keeps it there. So that's the way she is. So imagine she's always smiling. No, oh, she's always smiling. Right. She don't want to correct. Yeah, and it's not it's not a very good feature on her face. That's the other thing that they were saying. It's not mm, a good not feature. A good feature but she okay. never wanted she never wished nor could nor nor thought it was necessary to remove it, this mm. defect. Oh. Okay, so yes, so we yes. learned we learned a couple of things about um uh, about Anna. She's only forty and mm. uh, she's always lively but we already knew that she's always like full of animation and impulsiveness really, really impulsive and she's always means. enthusiastic and now we learn that she has a smile on her face all the time smile on her face yeah. all the time okay um thanks everyone